All right, what's going on guys? In this video, we are gonna be unboxing the Drawn Deck Starter. Um, first of all, these are available at spincityimports.com. I'll have a link in the description below. Um, it's a store that I own, so it is another way to help support the channel. But yeah, let's get into this. So I know this is the Asian Championship. Um, it's just like a set that has three recolors of um, Drawn Bays. It comes with a launcher it's basically the white launcher but it has like a gold little uh accents on it um but yeah i've heard that some of these might weigh more than their originals so we will go ahead and look at that i know some people weren't very excited because they thought we were going to be getting like a gold rush on drawn dagger and all that stuff but honestly there are still some pretty decent parts in here um i mean besides the uh, string launcher which is always good to get another one of those we get a 960, a low flat, which is really good. Um, 370, 70 height is getting better now that Silver Wolf is out. Um, Drawn Buster, one of the top attack bits in the game. Um, and then this Beyblade, Drawn Dagger, or Drawn uh, Sword is just garbage, I guess. But it looks really nice. Okay. Let's open this up. Make sure I don't expose my code. All right, my code has been removed. So this is what we get. We get these, which I think are pretty new lately, which is like a caution thing. Um, and I guess let me just pull these out. Now, I for one was very excited. I'm the one that runs Drawn Buster in my deck. So I was very, very excited to learn that um, there's going to be another recolor of Drawn Buster. The white and gold look really classy as well. So, excited about that. Alright, another string launcher. And again, you really can never have too many string launchers, I tell people. Because, look, you can't play the game if you can't launch the Beyblade. So, oh, wow. so that, let me just quickly... Throw that in the trash. Alright. So, since I'm excited, we'll open the Drawn Buster first. Also, probably because it is the one that you guys are most excited to see as well. So, here we have the Drawn Buster Blade. It looks magnificent. Um, just white metal coat, gold and black on the inside. The bit looks awesome. And then black. So I'm already thinking of really cool color uh, matching options. Now let's go ahead and weigh this. The average is around, I don't even know. I don't want to speak things that I don't know. But it's somewhere in the 36 range, mid 36. So you can't really see it. Holy crap, this one's 37. Can you guys see that? I don't know if uh, it's easy to see. 37 grams. Let me go ahead and just turn the scale off. Turn it back on. Weigh it one more time. 37. Holy cow. That is insane. Okay. Rest of the parts. We have 370. I really do like these new colors. I think they look nice. I don't know why we got, what is this, needle? I don't know why we got needle and disc ball again. To, to be completely honest, I just, I don't understand why we had to get those in this uh, legendary set. Oh, sorry. Throw this away. Moving stuff around here. Let's assemble this. These are such terrible scissors. I got them at Ikea. And they're so bad. Wow, 37 grams. The only other 37 gram Drawn Buster I own was the Hasbro release the, uh, of Drawn Buster. Which isn't everywhere, I, I know, but... Now, I have heard that there are 36 gram versions of this Drawn Dagger. So, I guess we will go ahead and see if that is true. So let me pull the scale back out. Oh, 
36.1. That's not bad at all. Okay. So I will assemble this. And this has that really nice 960. And 960 is one of the best ratchets in the game. Really good for stamina types. And really good for um, some attack types where you don't want any really contact points on the ratchet. And then low flat. So... Well, fat, flat looks a little bit worse than I was expecting. It looks more brown than it does gold, but that's okay. The blade looks awesome. Now we have drawn sword. I don't know what this usually weighs, but this one weighs 34.8, so around 35. Which, honestly, that's pretty heavy for one of the first blades that got released. And then, I don't even know if you guys care to see this, but it is gold for... 480 and then disc ball so that is a squirrel jumping on the door that's that's crazy here's the blades now i guess we will open this launcher up let's see if you know it's smooth seems pretty good looks pretty nice Nothing special, just another launcher. It almost kind of feels like a reskin of the white one they already had released. But again, can never have too many launchers. Trust me, especially in X, I hear all these stories of people breaking theirs. And yeah, that is, uh, that's tragic. But yeah, here we have the Beyblades. We have Drawn, Drawn Sword 480 Disc Ball. Probably the worst one of the bunch. Drawn Dagger, the newer, heavier mold, 960 low flat, one of the, the second best one. Like, if this was, if this combo, the 960 low flat, were on Drawn Buster, oh my gosh, it'd be so over. Um, but yeah, 960 low flat, definitely worth picking up. And then this Drawn Buster, this heavy mold, oh my goodness, let me see if I can... It looks so good, um, man. And honestly, I almost want to strip the paint off of this just to see what it would look like, just silver, but with the black and the gold on the inside. Um, so like the original metal, just unpainted, but with the black and gold, I think would also look super sick. And then this comes with 370 needle, um, and again, 370 is okay. 70 height is getting better. But, you know, 970, 770. Um, yeah, and hopefully, hopefully 170 here soon. But yeah, that has been the video. I hope you guys enjoy. And yeah, I'll catch you later. Again, check out SpinCityImports.com. Peace.